Well, we're learning more tonight about the new school superintendent in Sumter. Dr. William Wright's going to start in July after the current superintendent, Dr. Penelope Knox, leaves at the end of June. Dr. Wright spoke with us one-on-one -on -one about his life and education and hopes for the district. Here's News 19's Kaylin Hagwood. Dr. William Wright is no stranger to education. As a boy, his mother gave him a glimpse of his future. My mother uh, was a career educator, so she was working in the school. So I started as a substitute teacher. And the thing about education is once you get involved in education, it's kind of difficult to, to get out of it because you get to impact the lives of students. Perhaps it was part fate and part passion for the husband and father of two who went on to become a middle school and a high school principal, an assistant superintendent and a superintendent twice over. I believe in collaborative leadership. Good organizations and particularly school districts move forward when you maximize the potential of the employees that serve. He's currently serving as head of Hertford County Schools in North Carolina, home to about 2,900 students, but has worked at larger districts in the past as assistant superintendent. That particular experience uniquely qualifies me for the district, the size of Sumter, if you will, um, coupled with the fact that the smaller the district, the more uh, involved a superintendent is. When he begins at Sumter School District in July, Dr. Wright hopes to build on the successes of Sumter Schools, getting to know the community and partnering with stakeholders. I am absolutely committed to uh, staying around. We're going to come in and, and take some time to really understand who we are and listen to multiple stakeholders. For Street Squad Sumter, I'm Kaylin Hagwood. And well, uh, while Dr. Wright officially begins in July, he says he'll be working with district leaders to decide on replacements for two other high-level leaders at the district who announced they're also leaving at the end of the school year. Chief of Schools Dr. Brenda Hafner and Chief Financial Officer Jennifer Miller. They will start new jobs in July. Hafner has taken an education job in Somerville. Miller will take over as the Chief Financial Officer in Lexington District 1.